Radio Raheem with Jesse Vargas after the Manny Pacquiao fight, 12-round decision loss. We'll hear what the ex-champ has to say. When you came with the flurries, I, I think that possibly the, fur, the flurries were, were, were could have made him look like he was up, but the flurries weren't connecting. I mean, the flur when the flurries came, you know, I, I, was able, I was able to move left, right, and, and, and I didn't feel him connecting, but, you know, I got to look back at the at the video and, and see how it looked. Like I overall, you know, I apologize to my fans. I tried my best. You know, I, I promised to come back stronger, and I tried looking for the victory. I tried connecting with the big shots. I mean, you, I threw more punches than Manny, so I was looking for the win. Jesse, how do you feel, feel that hearts? he has incurred 16 stitches after the fight with you? What? Uh, he has 16 stitches? Yep. Oh, well, I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, it is what it is. I mean, uh, what can I say? You know, um, he's cut too. It was, it, was a, it was a fight. You know, um, this is what we fight for, you know, to give the fans a good fight. You know, sometimes we get, uh, you know, bumps and bruises and cuts. But overall, we do it for the fans, and we hope that you enjoyed it. You know, um, I apologize for not getting the victory to my fans, but overall, you know, I hope you enjoyed the fight. That's what we, we fight for. Even yeah. though you're being apologetic, do you actually believe you fought a very good fight to actually squeak out? It was a chess match, man. I mean, there's no way you can tell me the contrary. It was a chess match. He wouldn't come in for a reason. Why do you think he wouldn't come in? You know, so I was in there alive. I had a step. The only time I felt I, I kind of got a little la lazy or confident was in the second round when I went down. After that, I was awake. I was, I was trying to catch him with that right hand. When it's a chess match, it's a good fight. We were both thinking in there. I mean, we wanted to win. You know, we're both overthinking, trying to look look for big shots. You know, that means it was a good fight. And also remember the punch Jesse, that Jesse, show. Jesse, he threw now. more punches total, more jabs, and more power shots. Uh, many had the advantage on connection, but you know, shows it was a dead even fight. Both guys were fighting, and many only threw 408 punches total. So it had to deal, have something to do with Jesse also. It wasn't a one-sided fight. It was a very competitive fight. Jesse, would you like to I was expecting him to come in more, you know, he's an offensive fighter. And I said, we're going to catch him coming in. But he was he was uh, very respectful of my power. And um, it, didn't, it didn't surprise me, but I still felt that he would he would come in a little more aggressive. But, um, you know, hey, it's, a, it's an another another uh, experience for me. Would you like to see uh, Bradley again? Would you like to get in with him? You both lost to uh, Manny. I, I'm, uh, you know, you would leave it up, to, have to leave it up to my uh, manager and promoter, whoever they want me in with. Um, you know, uh, uh, I'm down. I'm down to come back and and, and fight whoever. But I, I assure you that we'll come back stronger. My team and I will, you know, go back to the drawing board, perfect a few things, look at the video, and see what things we can co we can correct. And um, you know, he, Manny Pacquiao has more fights, uh, more world championship fights than I have fights. You know, so uh, it was a good learning experience, and I promise to get back stronger. And it was, it was an even fight. I'll fight anyone, though. I'll fight anyone. Everybody knows that. Who will you want to fight? 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 Who will you want to fight?